Where would the supremacists be if it wasn't for the slave trade? If it wasn't for that loan they took out from the same tyrannical people that they claim to have fled from? Where would the supremacists be if it wasn't for their Spanish and French allies? Where would the supremacists be without Africans and Native Americans building America for them? Where would the supremacists be without the trillions of dollars that black and brown Americans spend annually in this country? The answer is white supremacists would be the black people of Europe if it wasn't for the Africans that they bought and sold. Think about all of the mass rapes, mass genocides, mass murders, mass thievery, any word that you can put with mass, they did it. They did all of those monstrous, horrific things just to end up here today in 2024, still as mediocre as ever. In any building where we're allowed to thrive without regulation, we outwork them. The supremacists exceed no expectations nowhere ever in history. They've always been mediocre, but their claim to fame is brutality. But my question to black people, Hispanic people, Native Americans, what happens when we all choose to be just as brutal and stop living in fear of the consequences that would come from us treating them how they treat us?